uh, beginning in the 1950s and 60s, the physicists began to discover that the fundamental forces of physics, the f many of the other fundamental parameters of physics, were uh, exquisitely finely tuned, meaning that if you have, for example, the force of gravity, if it's a little stronger or a little weaker, um, life in the universe will not be possible. There's a whole range of parameters that that fall within very, very narrow tolerances. And one of the scientists who discovered the first set of these fine-tuning parameters was named F uh, Fred Hoyle, Sir Fred Hoyle, a great British astrophysicist. And he had been a longtime scientific atheist uh, who opposed the discovery of the, the beginning of the universe, the Big Bang idea, because he thought it smacked of the Genesis account, and he didn't like that. But he later himself changed his worldview upon discovering these fine-tuning parameters. And he, at one point, was quoted as saying that the best data we have, meaning about the fine-tuning, suggests that a super-intellect has monkeyed with physics and chemistry in order to make life possible.